Wendy Anna, she's over there. Can you wave to Wendy? So, uh, so he's not available. <laughs> and uh, we're good friends. Aurel is a very powerful uh, personal counselor, evangelist. And I really appreciate when, uh, when you guys pray. You know, you're the first ones. If you complain about something, Aurel will be the first one to say, okay, stop right there, let's pray. Amen. And, <laughs> isn't that true? Right. All right. So, uh, so uh, Aurel, why don't you just uh, talk, tell us a little bit about you? Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Number three. Good time. Oh, now it is. Oh, really? <laughs> wow. It's nice to see everyone here this morning. I'm, I'm not going to talk too long. Uh, the thing that the Lord put on my heart to share is a verse, and as far as my past, let's just say that Brother Lee last week sort of summed it up in one shot. I was on the way where the devil didn't even bother with me because I was doing exactly what he wanted so that I would be joining him. God had other plans. And because he had other plans, here I am today. Amen? Amen. I, the, every, every man of God that I've met, every prophet that I've met, the prophetic word was, the devil wants to destroy you. He hates you with a passion. And he has to stop. But you know what? The Bible says, greater is he that is in me than him that is in this world. Amen. I want to the, the thing that basically God really put at least on my heart this week was to say this I want to challenge every one of you that is here this morning okay you all have been most of us have been in that mud that murky water that murky mud where you're up to here and Jesus came down and said come on out of there thank you Jesus Amen. a lot of us have been there and so we know what we're talking about. Yes. And if you're there right now, even by the internet, if you're there right now, and you say, there's nothing I can do here. I, I don't know what to do anymore. Please, look up. Your redemption draws nigh. Look up. For today is the day of salvation. Today is where Jesus comes down and gets you right out of the mud. Amen? Amen. Amen. Now, uh, very often uh, people, very often people come to you for uh, for prayer. Yes. And so you don't have a very kind of visible uh, ministry here. But uh, for how long have you been, uh, you know, attending to the meetings? Uh, from this, these meetings? <laughs> from the beginning, oh, right? Or, yeah, from the beginning. About what? Six years? Seven years? Now? Yes. So, so, so. Uh, uh, but then we. Um, uh, uh, kind of devised a way of doing church in more attractive way. Right. Now, um, I know that you're uh, from a, a more charismatic, Pentecostal, you know, prophetic, uh, right. <laughs> gift of the spirit uh, background. And here on Sunday, we do kind of a more of a mild Christian atmosphere. Right. How do you see, you know, being in different environments, like you go, uh, you know, to different kinds of meetings? Well, the thing is, it, it basically, it is to, get, so let's put it this way, original church, it's kind of hard. Because original church is a lot of judgment. In different meetings that I've seen here so far, the judgment part is left at the door. Thank you, Jesus! We are here. We are here because God wants you to be here. That's great. Now, okay. i like to do something special. i like to invite Wendy to come here close to you. And i like to pray for you both as a family. And Aurel and Wendy, they develop uh, also work, a small group in uh, Hanawaki. And they have a, this heart for First Nations. I'd like you two to stand and ready to pray for them. And, uh, and we want to see a strong, spirit-filled, gospel-driven ministry uh, arriving to, to the reserve in Hanawaki. By the way, tonight we, we're together in Oka, in Kansas Attack, and we're going to show the Holy Ghost movie there. It's going to be a blast. We're going to pray for everyone. 
And uh, but let's just, you know, stretch your hand and to pray for them and ask blessings so that their God will lead them in ministry. God, I thank you for Aurel and Wendy. I praise you for everything that you're doing in their lives. And there's a lot more that you have to do. There's so many things in place. And I pray for open doors for ministry there in the, in the native reserves. Uh, God, and, and you have a way of opening doors that no man can shut. And I pray, Lord, that the, the doors in Kanawaki will be open again. And that we'll see, Lord, a strong church rising there. In Jesus' name. Amen.